This Tavistock Braves local sports report is brought to you by the Synergex Group, a proud supporter of the Braves. Contact Synergex for all your hardscaping and interlock needs at 519-301-5060 or visit their website at synergexgroup.ca. The Tavistock Braves unveiling their Doherty Division championship banner before Friday's season opener. Former Braves captain Jared Yancey on hand for the ceremony. The Braves beat the Air Centennials in seven games last spring to bring home the title and the same two teams meeting on Friday night. Nolan Ferris is the new captain of the Centennials who were shooting for their first win of the young season. Opening period a big hit in the neutral zone. McKinnon Hawkins leveling Stephen Holmes. The Sens for Forward was down for a minute or two, but he was okay, and Holmes stayed in the game. Meanwhile, Justin Labrie is one of the new faces in the Braves lineup this year. He played double A last year with the Waterloo Wolves, and a good chance for Labrie to score his first Junior C goal, but he is denied by Ryan Box. The game is still scoreless. Midway through the frame now, Thomas Byrne chasing down the loose puck. Jen Jensen Van Bokel, the poke check. Nice play from the Tavi netminder, still scoreless. Later, the puck bouncing to Samson Walsam in front. Great chance, but Box turns him away. The game is scoreless after 20 minutes. Second period now, Tanner Johnson gets the first goal of the season for Tavistock as he whacks it home. Johnson giving his team a 1-0 lead. Then a little later, Zach Berg banging his stick. He wants it, gets it, and scores. Berg beating Box, and the Braves take a 2-0 lead. The Sens answer, though, before the period is over. Ben DeMoe down the far side comes in and snipes. Air is back within one. It's 2-1 Tavistock after two. Let's go to the third. Cole Corvo to Tate Hilliard, and he makes no mistake, restoring the two-goal lead. The former Waterloo Wolves major midget defenseman giving Tavi a 3-1 lead. Back comes Air, and it's the captain scoring his first goal of the season. Nolan Ferris putting it home. The Centennials closing the gap. It's 3-2. Later, it's Josh Boris starting the play, and it's the Braves captain finishing it off in front. Jake Whiffen scoring his first goal of the season. That makes it 4-2. Tavistock would add one more, and they take it by a final score of 5-2 over the Centennials. Tate Hilliard's first career Junior C goal in his first ever game is the winner. Here is Hilliard after the game. To be honest, it was all blur. I just moved the puck up to Corvo. He gave me a nice feed and I put it in. Don't really remember it that well, but helped us get the win, so that's all that matters. Waterloo Major Midget last year was great. You know, we had a great team. We went really far, lots of ice. Just helped me improve, helped me become a better hockey player. I think that was pretty cool. He's going to be a good D-man for us. He's young. We got a bunch of other young guys on the team that will probably end up doing the same, scoring their first goal early and just carry on from there. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.